Retrotech 100. Hello and welcome to Retrotech 100. I've been using this as an arcade stick for quite some time. It's just a piece of wood with these buttons in. I've had it for ages. Ever since I took my arcade desk apart, I've been using that. If you want to see the original video, there's a link here up the top there in the corner. Uh, but it's not great, obviously, because it's all loose and stuff. The encoder and all the buttons and the joysticks all exposed. I mean, I could have built something around it, but I don't really have the time. About six weeks ago, I got this. I think it was about 11 or 12 quid on eBay. It's um, what it is really, it's just a plastic box um, with the channel out for a wire there. And then this is some sort of plastic um, top. And to be honest, I think it's gonna do, oh, oh hello. I think it's gonna do okay. So I'm gonna move the encoder, buttons and stick from there to in there and I'll let you know how I'll get on and how I think this for 11 or 12 quid works as an arcade stick. So I removed the buttons, the stick and the encoder from the old arcade stick that I made. So I'm gonna put it into this one. I'm gonna put these into the top and it came with some hardware. So hopefully I'm gonna have the right bolts because when I got this, I removed the bolts and I use screws to go into the wood. So I think I'll get on that first. Quite a fiddly process to hold these bolts in because obviously you've got your stick going through so you can't lie it down. You've got to hold all four bolts. With your fingers. That's not bad. I haven't kept track of where I pulled the buttons from the encoder. So if I plug all the buttons back in, my Raspberry Pi is going to be a bit confused. So I'll run the Retro Pi Toolkit. And that'll wipe my button configuration. And I can start again. Right, time to stick the buttons in. So there's all the buttons in the case. Yeah, it's not bad at all. There we are, there's the uh, okay stick bolted down. Don't know if these are gonna be a bit loose. They're not they're not great, but I don't think they'll fall out or anything. It was a bugger to get these out of my uh, wooden monstrosity. I really uh, was tight for that was. Now to position the encoder inside the case. I'm gonna leave the encoder loose in there until I get some Velcro. There doesn't seem to be a place to connect it. Um, on this encoder, uh, button one's here. So I'll just go along and hook all the buttons up without straining the uh, cable too much. Doesn't really matter where you put them because you can set them in retro file, obviously. So that's all your buttons connected, you just connect the stick up here. And there you go, everything connected except the USB. USB just connects here. Take that cable. Put it on there. There we are, she's all done. Let's see how she plays. So here it is in all its glory, I finished it. I've reset my RetroPie, so the configs will be not messed up when I go to set this up. You can uh, do that with RetroPie Toolkit. Um, that was made by Easy Hacks, I'll link it in the description below. Where it makes, if you've plugged in a, an arcade stick and you want to change the button config around, best is just to wipe it out and start again. So, as you can see it shows up. So we go up, down, left, right. Start, select, A, B, X, Y, left shoulder, right shoulder, and then hold the buttons because I haven't got any left. Good luck, good luck, good luck, kid.
I can see the sticks just fine if I show you there. This little kit's pretty nice all over. I think this cost about 12 quid. The link will be in the description down below. Um, it's really easy to put together. Just put the bolts through. It comes with some suction cups. I've not put them on yet. And obviously you buy your own stick. But I mean, uh, it doesn't weigh as much as my piece of wood. But it is still pretty nice. Get like punk. Um, I'd recommend this little kit. Uh, if you can buy your stick for 11 quid and you can get this for about 10 or 11 pounds, you've got a... A nice arcade stick there for about 22 quid, and you could chuck a raspberry pie in it. Go out and build your own arcade stick. This has been Retro Tech 100. I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.